First, we'll create a new script and name it door. Let's use the onTriggerEnter method. This will detect our player by a tag, which will open our door by a new function. We need a collider to be able to use onTriggerEnter. We can use this code snippet to automatically import a box collider when we add our script. Configure your box collider and enable the trigger checkbox. Don't forget to tag your player with the player tag. We want to add some properties to our door. First, the game object we want to rotate and the angle when the door is open. Drag the object you want to rotate into our new door property. I left the rotation as is. Now we can rotate our door with the properties we just configured. The door should open now. To finish up, we just need to write some code to allow it to close. This is just the opposite of what we've already done. We detect when the player leaves using the onTrigger exit method and write a new method to reset the door rotation upon close. And now we have a functional and reusable door component. When I say reusable, you can go ahead and drop this component onto any object and it can now act as a door, or even double doors.